The bedroom's just at the top of the stairs. Wait. for replacing us. I'm not talking to you! I'm talking to Darwin! Why did you go fish them out of the trash? He made a promise never to abandon us. You can't make a promise to an object! That's like getting married to a fridge! Or keeping a secret for a shoe! And please stop talking through those puppets! He can't. He lives in our world now. And if you want to see him again, you too will have to come and play. <gasps> Darwin! Wake up! Wake up! Thank you, Master Gumball. I missed you greatly all these years. Now, shall we go and find Master Darwin? Wait, how do you know what happened? Just because I've been unable to talk does not mean that I've been unable to see. Remind me to apologize to Anais's dolls. They're right next to my underpants drawer. They've seen a lot. If that worried you, sir, I advise you not to look down. Okay, Gumball. Focus on the task at hand. Not hand! Focus on the task at hand. Ahead! Ta task ahead! Shh. Shush. Can you hear that, Master Gumball? This way. Wow! Look at all the things we imagined when we used to play. Hey, look! High five guy! Ah, good to see you, man! <gasps> it's Sammy Sunscreen! The Screaming Sun! <laughs> the Tree of Permanent Happiness! I wish I could feel all the things. <gasps> bird playing bird! Please stay focused, sir. Master Darwin needs you. Yeah, you're right. So just stop distracting me, keyboard dog! <laughs> Here we are. Dolls around the sing a song, the fun will never stop. Yeah! We are fun, all day long, it's a so on the clock. To wear a hat, wear no hat. Or wear two hats if you prefer. We only have two hats, so those are your only options. So grab the one and break a cake. And while you wait for the cake to bake, begin to prepare a second cake. You did it wrong with that first cake. It's your turn with the balloon! The fun will never end! Organize a spoon! The fun will never end! Count to the funnest number! The fun will never end! Go to your favorite corner! The fun will never end! I don't know what's going on! The fun will never end! I'm not sure if this is that fun! The fun will never end! What was that? A dramatic record scratch sound! Dude, we gotta go! This is all a trap to keep you playing with them forever! You're wrong. You see, there are three of us, Master Gumball, and Darwin only has two hands. This was a trap for you. Dum, dum, dum. What was that? Yeah, a dramatic music cue. It would have been better if my voice wasn't so flat. You always used to play with us. Now's our turn to play with you. So play along, don't make a fuss. And we'll come up with things to do. We'll make you dance, we'll make you fight. You'll smear yourself with worms all night. We'll make you eat toenails and grease. We'll make you wear an itchy fleece. We'll see if you break when you bend. The fun will never end. The fun will never. Wait, what's that? The end of the fun. <laughs> Is it me or is that kind of underwhelming? Yeah, I sort of thought everything would explode or something. Wait, isn't this all imaginary? Oh, good point. No! I will have my revenge! What else could we give away? You've not seen them yet, but no. Seen what? No. <laughs> Oh, Gumball, we have to play with... No! But why? Because we're 
too old to play with toys and dolls. Playing never goes out of date. Playing with dolls means you'll never go out on a date. Mm. Come on, man. Time to grow up. <sighs> you're right. I need to learn to let things go. That's it. Trust me, you'll thank me when your teenage years kick in. I know. <laughs> Hello, guys. Hello! <laughs> <coughs> Ew, what's that smell? Morning breath can be quite bad when you've been asleep in the shoebox for seven years. Come on, Frank. I'm sure Darwin had a perfectly good reason to leave us in there in endless darkness with only dust mites for food and our love for him to keep us warm. Right? What was that? That was the weight of guilt, Howdy. <gasps> I'm sorry. We ditched you guys the Christmas we got our first game console. That's okay. We still love you. And you'll never put us back in the box, will you? I promise. And we'll have fun forever and ever? I promise. And you'll never take us off your hands again, right? I promise. Sorry, but you did make me promise. <gasps> Ooh, where have you been all my life? Mm, sitting here wondering what went wrong with mine while eating cheese. Well, one ticket to Kiss Town, please. What the dude? <laughs> is a total write-off. I guess that's what happens when you put a 15-ton vehicle in the limp little hands of a ventriloquist dummy. <laughs> hey, what's wrong with being a puppet? Big talk for someone so short you can see his feet on his yearbook photo. What's your problem, man? And what's with the voice? My problem is that your butt is twice as wide as your shoulders, but your brain is half the size of your head. Oh, anything else? No, I can try to insult your face, but I think nature's already done enough damage. At least that solves the problem of how to eat without your hands. Oh my goodness, who's getting those puppets? Shh, those are my socks, and keep it down, or Gumball will hear you. Did you say something? No. Then who were you just talking to? <laughs> Nobody? <laughs> You don't even have lungs. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Darwin, we've been over this. You don't understand. They're more than just... Yeah, dude, can you cover yourself up first? Oh, yeah, sorry. But Gumball, we're more than just puppets. Darwin, you know who talks through puppets? Crazy people and people who want to make a living as a ventriloquist. So, yeah, crazy people, basically. Gumball, we need you, too. Who's gonna play with Grady? Dude, no, just take them off. No! Oh, oh, no! Wait, what are we doing? Finally! Thank you. You're supposed to fall over, not under. <coughs> Frank, stop it! Oh, no, you stop! Ow. You both stop! Oh, no, you stop! stop. Yeah. 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 <sighs> you used up all the water. <laughs> Darwin, when I said grow up, I didn't mean go straight to the part where you're in a retirement home screaming at chairs and biting the nurses. No, please don't do this. You don't understand. They're alive. No, they are not. No, not the shoebox. It's almost as dark as your soul in here. Oh. Oh. Yeah, uh, dude, they are not the ones who need help. You okay? You don't look quite yourself. Maybe there's something I haven't digested properly. <laughs> Frank, wrong body. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's go. 